to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a quick and easy hairstyle video because everyone gets these mornings where you wake up late for school or for work and you just, you know, don't have enough time to do something fancy with your hair. So I'm just going to teach you a few ways how to spice up a really, really quick hairstyle and they take literally like seconds to do. I love watching these videos personally. I love watching um, hairstyle videos because I get, get so much inspiration and that's what made me do one today. I really think it's going to help you guys out a bit and I really hope you enjoy it. I really hope you enjoy the hairstyles that I have picked out. I have so many hairstyles like I would love to show you in this video but the video would just be so long so if you do want a part two then I will do one. Go ahead and thumbs up this video if you would like that. And yeah. I think that's all I have to say. Um, also, you might have noticed that I'm in a different background. I'm in a bathroom, which the lighting is fabulous. <laughs> it's really good. I really like the lighting, and also hopefully the sound is alright because at the moment, me hearing myself is really echoey, and I just I don't know if it's going to be alright on camera. So that's all I have to say. Let's get right into the video. I'm really excited to do this, and I will see you guys soon. Bye. Sexy voice silver time, here we go. So the first hairstyle is a messy pony. It's really straightforward. All you're gonna do is shove all that hair on top of your head using your fingers. Then just tug at the ponytail a little to loosen it. And then what I'm gonna do also, this is optional, but I'm just going to pull out a few hairs at the front just to frame my face. So pretty, it's such a cute hairstyle and really, really simple too. I love this hairstyle so much because it's just really simple to do and it looks like really nice too. I use this when I'm doing sport or lounging around the house. I just think it's really cute and simple and it just keeps my hair out my face. Being myself, I'm just posing for like a really long time. This is kind of getting weird. So moving on to the next hairstyle, I'm gonna call this the classic sleek ponytail. And all I'm going to do is I'm just going to push all my hair onto my head using a tangle teaser, combing through any knots, just making it really sleek. And then I'm just going to tie that with a hair tie once it's all pushed back. If you really want it all pushed back, including all flyaways and stuff, I'd recommend using some pomade or some hairspray just to keep it back. But I didn't do that this time, but I would normally do that. So just to double check that there's no knot in the ponytail, I'm just going to comb through that again and then I'm also going to push the ponytail forward a little bit just to create a little bit of volume on the crown section. Then I'm just going to grab a little piece of hair from the ponytail, wrap it around the base and then secure it with a bobby pin. So if you're looking for a more classier look, then this is definitely the look for you. It's definitely more elegant and but still really simple and everyone knows that Kim K rocks this look all the time. So moving on to the half up and half down hairstyle, I'm just going to part my hair right above the ear and then just section off that part using a hair tie. I'm going to smooth that down with a tangle teaser just to get rid of any lumps and bumps and then just tie that with a hair tie. 
I just loosened that ponytail up a tiny bit just to make it a little bit more messier and then I'm just pulling some hairs down at the front to frame my face. I freaking love this hairstyle so much and I wear it like a lot of the time. I think it's just really cute and simple way to get the hair out of your face. Wait into the furthest oceans I made my way through Just going through the motions I left And does anyone else think it kind of reminds you of Ariana Grande's hair? I don't know, these voiceovers are so awkward. Oh my god, I love this hairstyle so much, but I'm just gonna get onto it. I'm gonna be calling this one the messy top knot, even though it's not a messy top knot because a top knot is like all of your hair, but this is like half your hair. But anyway, I'm just going to tie half of my hair up, parting it at right above the ear, and then I'm just gonna mess up a bit by tugging at it, then pulling some hairs down from the face. Then I'm just gonna grab the ponytail and then wrap it around like a bun and then secure it with some bobby pins. You literally have to put like no effort into this hairstyle and that's like what I love about it because it's like so adorable. I love it. It brings back all the cutesy things when you were a kid. I don't know why it just does to me, but whatever. I love it. I think it's a really nice way to just get your fringe and your hair out of your face. And me just posing again for like hours and it, w it was so awkward doing this in my bathroom. <laughs> So you're probably wondering like why Tiana did you call it space tails but you'll get me in a minute. But basically I love this hairstyle, all I'm going to do is I'm just going to create two little pigtails on top of my head and leaving out my fringe because I just want a bit of that, you know. And it just looks like super cute and it brings back the 90s, I swear down this, oh I love it. Literally all I'm doing is like drawing a square or a circle um, part and I'm just grabbing all that hair and tying it with a hair tie and then just like loosen it up a bit, make it really cute, make it messy. I just think it's really, really adorable and I really think you should try it out and if you do, take a picture, post it on Instagram and tag me because this is my favourite hairstyle out of the five. And that actually ends the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed all these hairstyles and if you would like to see more then don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. But I'll see you guys soon in my next video. Bye!